Many mediums have careers which go on for decades. Over the course of decades, they will remember some of their better readings. Fact is, if a medium does a hundred, a thousand, or more readings every year, there will be a few good stories. Over the course of decades of doing thousands of readings, there will be so many good stories to pass on, it will seem to be quite remarkable. So when you write your book, or books, novels worth of stories, it seems to be incredibly impressive. You'd expect, if they can do half of what they say, it would not be the rare occasion where they show the proof. You know, rare occasions very often separated by months or years throughout the medium's or psychic's career. So the career of these psychics is pebble-dashed with failure. And yet, amongst these pebbles, you'll find an occasional diamond. Most of the readings would still be the generalisation, still the cold reading they don't fully realise is cold reading. And of course the occasional instance which they remember in favourable terms where they did incredibly well. Although they remember, as they prefer to remember, and they remember the hits, they remember the good parts, they remember it in a disproportionate way and therefore they remember it wrongly. So they take a hit perhaps a good hit, which is a rarity, and they remember it poorly, missing out their own misses, and then they report it to an interviewer, to an audience as a story, or to a selection of people in a workshop, or in one of their books. And it seems to be so remarkable. And many people would think, it can't be true. Well, guess what? You're right. And in fact, it isn't true. It's where they've got a few hits over the course of many years and they've embellished it within their own works, within their own writing and talks to try and make it seem like it's far more impressive. And then people pass on to me and other sceptics these stories and say, how do you explain that? Even though there are no solid facts, there's no solid evidence there, there's merely the passed on idea of things that have allegedly happened. Is that serious proof? Of course not. Is that worth taking seriously? Hardly. What we can say is, if there are reports of seriously good phenomena, but they are dispersed over the course of years, that might be an indication of nothing more than chance from a half-decent believer.